Hello and welcome, I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Rajas of India for CK2. Alright, so this guy is now defending against Banbishen Kesser in the Dijur War over Banu. The Dijur War over Banu. Banu. Alright, so... My liege is attacking that guy in the Dijur War over Banu. So basically she's saying, hey, I am the queen of Afghanistan. Nope, that's not right. I am the Duchess of Gandhara, and so you are you should be my vassal. And uh, this guy is allied to this guy, so he's calling them in. Putting us on the front line, meaning we might get sieged, which sucks badly. Fortunately, we are making 40 ducats a year now, so it won't take too long to build up enough of a war chest to hire some mercenaries get some work done. Or if this guy somehow loses his levy, either due to his own occupation or something, we could kill him and put his zero-year-old on the throne. That would be nice. We have very low chance to do that. Yeah, let's try to kill the guy that we have a truce with still. It's fine. Just keep doing that. Hopefully they don't siege us. They might, but really what they should do is go for the war goal, and hopefully they're dumb enough to try to cross. No. They'll go to Nandana. Right? They're not going to go from Kop whatever it's called, straight to Ban Banu, are they? Oh my god, are you kidding me? This is disappointing, actually. Like, the, the, idio the idiocy of the AI here, just, it blows my mind. So they're going to they're gonna catch him. That's the war goal, so I can see why they want to go there. But, it, I mean, there's a major river crossing. Crossing of a major river from Indus... Um, wait, what? Crossing of a major river to... Yeah. Oh, it's named Indus. Okay, that's the Indus River. I get it. So yeah, crossing of a major river to Banu. So why not just go to Nandana and then at least reduce the penalty? I mean, they could lose. They could very easily lose this fight. Unless, of course, these guys arrive at the same time. They could still lose. I mean, look, defending in the mountains after a major river, I just don't understand it. Look at this. They, they, they did win, but they... Oh, god damn it, and I got captured? How dare you make me lead troops? You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> That's dumb. That is really dumb. Oh, jeez. Would you please not have me in prison? Please. Now I have to pay 70 damn ducats just to get out of prison. He's not going to let... He, he won't just generously let us go. I don't want to die yet. This character still has claims that won't be inherited by successors. Like our, our claim on our father's homestead. I hate this queen. I hate my liege. All of a sudden, she's uh, pretty happy with me. She doesn't seem to remember that I tried to kill her. Okay, that's good. Well, let's try to kill her again then. <laughs> we kill her husband. Kill her heir. No, nope. no one really wants to kill her heir. Uh, let's see who's. So Sayan is the next in line to inherit. That's her second-born son. Yeah, there's really no no value actually in trying to kill him. A daughter was born. We have a granddaughter, a sickly one. She's very happy with us, apparently. She knows how long we've reigned. The very first thing they did when they pulled her out of the womb was say, Just so you know, your liege has been ruling for 40 years. You should respect him. <laughs> and she said, Okay. <laughs> All right, so, um, hey, you, would you please give me the lands that belong to me? And how about you? I no longer have a valid Cassus Belli to attack you. Oh, that's right, because my claim on Shortcut is a weak claim. We need him to die. You must die, man. Large numbers of the famished defenders of Jalandhar have succumbed to starvation. Okay. Whose event is this? What are you talking about, game? Jalandhar. Why are you telling me about this? I, it's not even my war. What are you... Okay, I know she's... What? There's some random 
Hmm. I totally... I, I get it. Uh, no. I refuse. Because I think you're dumb. My grandsons will be educated by me. Or by somebody better suited to that position. Yes, me. Definitely me. I'm not going to let this woman do anything that she wants. I will educate them. Train them in the ways of fighting. And, uh, let's see. Two... Just, just one of my boys came out homosexual, so I guess we... You know, the first one we made a few mistakes with when it came to how to teach him how to fight. And uh, it didn't, didn't work out quite the right way. Not that there's anything wrong with being homosexual. It's just that, you know, it hurts your fertility with in this game. All right, come on, kill the guy. If he dies, then his heir is a woman, which means we should be able to press our weak claim. We've succeeded. He died not knowing the name of the arc. his killer. Now we can press a weak claim against her. How many troops do you have, woman? 183. Sounds ideal. Claim it. Go. Bam. Fire. Fire the missiles. Go. We're back to growth. I like this. Her own personal holdings is just that one thing. Hey, we have a courtier who likes us. And she is lustful. Yes. Make a move. I like bastards. Gave her a good tumble. We have a new lover. What is this nonsense? Oh, God. So, this guy here is, um... He's hostile to us because he's attacking our liege. And I think what's happening is he's just trying to go home or, like, go take back this thing. Or I don't know. But he is pathing right through our our very small levee. And he will be here on the 11th. Can we escape? Yes, we can. All right. So, you know what he's probably doing, actually, is because I raised my levee and took my garrison away. Sorry, my just the levee away. Now my holdings are less defended, so he's trying to come to siege my holdings in order to speed up his war goal. Now that I've just released the levy, maybe they will not. Nope, they're trying to take Lahore. Alright, well we'll go siege Shortcut, which is 600. No, that's a bad idea. Would you please stop it, you stupid liege? You are causing me so many problems. God damn it! All my well-made plans... You have to declare war. Of course you do. You declare war on somebody who has, like, the biggest next-door neighbor as a friend. At least this is going to take a long time for him to siege, because it's got 1,500 troops. Our wife, he just died. Alright, so we are a uh, Kshatriya, so let's find ourselves a new Kshatriya wife. This one is 24 and ambitious. She is a Vaishya, though. So, third-born. Third cast. You know what would have made a whole lot more sense, I think, on these tooltips is one, two, and three. You know, just put the dumb number on there. Ugh. I'll get used to it, but that's a traitor. Or at least let us filter it. I'm going to keep complaining. I will. This one's pretty good. I like her stewardship. Everything else kind of stinks, but she's the right cast. Scholarly theologian. I, I could swear that that icon changed. We'll take her. Sounds good. Our new wifey. We'll take the uh, the money, I think, because we could use mercenaries soon, possibly. We're still making 50, uh, 41 ducats a year now. Please don't siege my holding. Please leave my holding. We are buying our liege time to possibly reamass troops, but she's such an idiot that I doubt that she'll succeed. Can we kill her? You stupid woman. Get out of my land! I need to siege Shortcut! I need to take my father's lands back. This is important, don't you understand? Okay, okay, whoa. What just happened? Something just changed. Alright, they're still allies. She ended her war. How come I didn't get a pop-up about it? Truce with Banu. It was a, uh... It was won by Thakur of Banu, so she lost her war. Alright, whatever, that's fine. We just need our war goal. I should have gotten a pop-up, shouldn't I? My message settings got all messed up. Military. It might be because I turned off a war you were not a part of ends. Oh, no, but it's this one. Yeah.
Let's do that one. That should make it work. Okay. We're ready to siege. Let us hope so. Yes, indeed. Look at this. We might even be able to take a province without hiring mercenaries. That is epic. Hey there, woman. Uh, you look like you'd be an excellent concubine. She's got the little dot and everything. All right, my son wants to become spy master with 11 intrigue. He is better than our landed guy, but unfortunately, our landed guy is landed. So, the answer is no. I am now wounded. Apparently, I'm leading troops in places for this stupid woman. I don't want to lead your troops. Don't you know how much I hate you? I don't think she does. What is this all about? A Sunni uprising. Interesting. It's okay. It's all right. We're going to win this war. Um, we have... <clears throat> and then we're going to attack this guy. Oh, it is. It's the three-year-old. Ah, special interest. So hopefully she has fewer troops now. Nope. <laughs> She's still got the most. She's got 900. But we almost have enough money. We can hire some mercenaries and pick that up. We are well on our way to getting control of this playthrough. It really threw us a loop when our initial liege lost his holy war, stole one of our provinces without any notice, just took it. It's kind of dumb. And then from there it's just been an uphill struggle to actually get get territory, you know? And this will actually put us at our domain limit, so we're going to have to become a duke. We have to become a duke. You surrender? Great, we accept. Alright. Hey you, what are you doing in my lands? So you are attacking us. Holy War from Molten. So you're trying to take lands from our liege here, basically. And so you're sieging us. Well, we're not going to let you damage our loot bar. We're going to go to Lahur though, so we can avoid the river crossing. We've recovered from another injury that our stupid liege got us into. Uh, river crossing from here to DePalper. There is. So I guess it doesn't matter then. Just get away. We really... Uh, yeah, hmm. I don't really want to fight you, but I guess we will. We'll put some people in charge, too. Look at that. We were actually gaining morale for a second. What's this forest? Jungle. Defender bonus jungle. Ugh. Well, we did win. And we caught Marzoban Bakar. Cool. Alright, well that paid for itself then. Because now we can ransom that man. Oh, that's right, and there's changes to who we can assassinate, like murder without repercussions. Well, we're definitely going to ransom him right away, because the 70 gold is really useful. I like this music. There's a crusade for Jerusalem in 926. That's insane. Okay, so Shorkot needs to recover. Our vassals are fairly happy with us. We've got a few that are barely negative. But they're just a little upset that we changed succession law. We've got maximum city levies right now. Now that we have three own of our own provinces, we can probably scale back levies as well. And then work towards more of a taxation situation. This is weird. Oh, is he actually still the youngest? Okay. I thought that I had one that was younger than that. So it goes Shamshir Juti. Shamshir Juti, Shamshir Yeah, that doesn't help much. So the two twins. And then it goes to the grandson, who is the son of probably not the heir. Interesting. Whatever. Doesn't matter. All that matters is that it's not Gavelkind, so we can keep together what we have. Now, the next step is to become a Duke of Lahore so that we can hold on to more territory. And to do that, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's seven provinces. We need one more. We cannot, however, usurp it off of someone's primary thing. Like, it's going to be, th that new rule is going to affect our ability to take this from her. So we need a claim on Sakala, I think. Remember that new rule that you can't usurp someone's last title if they still hold titles in that area? So we need to take Sakala so that she only owns this one, which is outside of that duchy, 
which will allow us to then usurp it. So we're going to go temporarily over the domain limit, but then we'll have the duchy, which will then raise our domain limit, and then we'll be fine. So we need a claim on that. Please make a claim. Get the claim. Go. In the meantime, if we wanted to, we could attack this guy. Um, just for the sake... We'll, we'll be over the domain limit, but we would have another province. And this claim is not going to be inherited unless pressed in war, so we should probably do that. But she has a few troops, you know. 968, and we have about that many. I think we'll do it. Let's just do that now. We'll declare war on you. We're going to take your province. We're going to raise up our men. We're going to hire some cheap mercenaries. And we're going to rally to here, and we're going to go take your stuff. And we have just such a numbers advantage that it doesn't even matter now. Mercenaries, well worth it. And we'll go beat up the remaining army, I think. And now we could... We could just um, let her surrender, but I think we'll siege through all of her stuff. To get some... like the chance. If we just get one... If we just get one or two prisoners, it'll pay for the mercenaries. That's my plan. But I'm going to take a break here. I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. See you again soon.